This scam starts with this email. It informs the consumer that a computer tech support plan has just been auto-renewed for $499. Oh, yes, you have to just confirm me the order number. So I did what any consumer would do who doesn't want to lose $500. I called the number on the email to cancel it. So this was a confirmation email. Could you please confirm me what you want to do, sir? Do you want to cancel this plan and get your refund back or you want to continue with that plan, sir? Without me even having to ask, the technician Peter immediately offers to cancel the charge and refund my money. But he can't tell me where my refund is even going. And I have several bank accounts and several credit cards and I don't know where this is going. I don't know where you took the money from. We are not authorized to tell any personal details such as card details or banking details over the phone call or ask the customer details over the phone call. If we do that, we, are, we might lose our job. Peter can't tell me where the refund is going because I haven't actually been charged, but I continue to play along. Okay, let's cancel the service. How do we go about that? So you have to just be seated in front of the computer. I'm going to just provide the cancellation ID. Peter directs me to type in a website. Okay, so click on track my order and you will provide me with the cancellation ID. Now what can you see, sir? It says team viewer for Windows. Now can you see a green color checkbox? says download 64-bit version. I want to know what is going to happen when I click onto that green button. Sir, uh, nothing is going to happen, sir. This is where I stop following his instructions because there's no way of knowing what will happen once you click on a link like that. Peter, I believe that once I click if on this green button you told me to click on, you're going to be able to download things from my computer and access my computer. And that's the last thing in the world that I want. That, Peter, is a scam. Sir. Nothing will happen into your computer. You have to just believe me. Peter, let me be very blunt with you. I think you're a scam artist. I think you're part of a scam operation that once you get into my computer, you're going to access my bank account and try to take money from me. He terminated the call. Now, once these scammers gain remote access into your computer, they have you log into your bank account. Then they manipulate your bank balances and they make it appear that they refunded you too much money. Then they demand you return that money through gift cards that you have to go out and purchase. This elaborate scam continues to grow using the names of all the major computer repair companies like McAfee, Norton, Symantec, and Best Buy. But preventing this scam is very, very simple, folks. Do not allow anyone to have remote access into your computer, no matter what story they're telling you. I'm Brian Roach on your side, WGAL News 8.